Yo, what's up everybody? It's Stefan here from Mod the Fame and we are back with another video. I'm here with the beautiful, amazing Gwen Rowe. And y'all see what's behind us, man. That's right, her beautiful, beautiful C7 Corvette. Let's jump into it. Let's go. Just a, I thought it was about that time for a change. So, what? a change from what? I mean, I mean, a change in your life, I mean, a change at work, my outfit, you know, right. my clothes, kind of my car. car. Your car? I know. Your I know. Car. It's been so good to me. So, you know, it was either go back to black because that's the original color for some of you that don't know. Right. Remain with this color, switch the color to a completely different color, get another Corvette like the ZR1, or get a completely different brand altogether. So, so that's where we are right now. Started to get another car? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> yo, I swear y'all, she would not tell me what I was yeah. doing out here. <laughs> Oh, yeah. It was a surprise. Yes, yes. So, oh, man. so I don't want I don't want it to hear because Right, right. No. <laughs> right, right. So right. I have decided since the ZR1s aren't like available now now, meaning you can't walk into the store five blocks away, five oh, miles away and get it. Local. Right. right. I'm gonna come over there with you. Okay. All I'm right. trying to understand this. Yes. You know what I'm saying? So as far as I know, you know, you done had this car, how long? I believe three years. You had this car for three years. 2016, bought it with three miles on it. First of all, what is it? What is this car? Corvette C, C7. Stingray, Stingray, right? Stingray, yes. Okay. And you got it brand new? Brand new. God damn. So you pulled up to the dealer. What was that experience like? Hold on, I'm gonna go back behind the camera. I'm sorry, y'all. Okay. I'll go. <laughs> how the hell you end up choosing a Corvette in the first place? I wanted something curvy like me a little bit. Ah, you wanted to No, no. But let me tell you, right? When I got to the dealership, I got it from Kerbeck in Atlantic City. Right. Anyone who has traveled from Long Island, New York City to Atlantic City, that's a bit of a drive. It is. So I didn't know everything about the vehicle until I got in it, signed all the papers, it's mine, whatever. A friend dropped me out there. I barely seen over the steering wheel for the entire two and a half, three hours that I drove that car back. <laughs> Okay. I swear, that's that's when you know your core muscles. You know when you work out and get that strong you core. Had to sit up. You yeah, had to sit yeah. Up. What did you have before this? Before this, I had a like a knockabout car because I was stationed about so what, a four hours away. You, so what made you want to get a Corvette? Like out of all cars, not not saying I'm not sexist at all, right? But you know what I mean. You kind of sounded like it. You no. had all the choices in the world. Yeah. What made you choose a Corvette? First of all, I don't like cliche. You know, oh, because she's a woman, she should be driving a this. Bima, you whatever. know, she should be driving a three series. You know, a little CLA. No. No. <laughs> no disrespect to the girls. No disrespect. It's CLA. But what I'm saying is that why must we conform, right? Okay. That's fair. I like aggression as it pertains to the look of the vehicles that I drive. You right. know, my, my weekend car. Right. So I wanted something with power, something with speed. 
it was a no-brainer. Damn, that's what's up. So over the last three years, what has been, what has this ownership experience been like for you? Let me put it like this. If the Corvette, if the C8 was out, it probably would have beat out the other options. Of the next car you're going to get. Correct. Even though, you know, some people would say, oh, first generation, you have to be a little wary about first generation. Right. You know, I would have taken the chance. That would have been the dealership's problem. Right. <laughs> if right. something went wrong with it, you know? In three years, right? Yeah. Have you had any issues with the car? No. It's the been... issue the issue was all me. I chose the wrong color. Don't get a black car. <laughs> Why not? Why shouldn't they get black cars, Gwen? Two reasons. You seem to like black. Look what you're wearing I right do. now. I do. I love black. Black is my color. So why shouldn't you get a black car? But we all know when you just wash a black car, there's nothing better than a washed, clean, clean yes. black car. Nothing yes. better. Yes. That first five minutes is going to be the best time of your life. I agree. But it on is. that six minute, <laughs> you just wait. There'll be dust, there'll be dirt, there'll be birds, and I'll be the one driving around a dirty Corvette because that, I'm not about the, White that life. Everywhere you go. No, I'm not about that life. I see it all the time. People, no, I don't care that much. Okay, I don't care so that much. what did you do to the car? Obviously, I see the wrap. Talk to us about that. I was gonna get it wrapped white because I'm, I'm kind of boring like that, you know, okay. even though the car itself is not boring, right? So I went back and forth with colors. I didn't want to do something cliche. I'm like, okay, I'm going to spend this money and I'm going to get a white car. I decided on getting this. I don't even remember. It's, it's something teal. I think atomic teal or something atomic to that appeal. Yeah, because it got like a neon to the teal. It's like, yes. it's like a very bright, poppy. Yes. So yes. I was surprised when I saw you with that because I know you like to be in stealth mode. I do. I mean, I do. Talk about how. And that's dark why it was. the tints are so dark. Yes. No. <laughs> you got some dark ass tints, Gwen. Yes. On the windshield, to the wind, the windshield, everything is tinted. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So you did, you did the wrap, and then I, it looks like the car has got some more done to it. What'd you do to the car overall? What else did you do? The front lip. Yep. And the side, the side skirt. And what are those, what's the, what are those made of? Carbon fiber. They're carbon fiber. And then um, the rear spoiler, is also what I did is I wrapped it a carbon finish. Ah, so it's, it's, the, it's the regular black it's spoiler the, you just right, wrapped it carbon right. to match. I didn't want it to be teal because then it'll kind of blend with the rest of the car. I didn't want to keep it black because nothing else on the car is black. Give me your favorite memory of ownership with this car. Uh, I, I know this is tough, but take it time. I know, I know. No yeah. rush. Had some really good runs in this car, including the, the last one. I forgot where we went, but I definitely have a nice little nick on the front, you know, as <laughs> from memory. From runs? Yes, yes, from the last one, wherever we went. I don't even okay. remember. When we went up to get the breakfast? Yeah, I think it was that time. Okay. It was that time. <laughs> Those pancakes were worth it. Overall, what's the, what do you remember? What are the things that you did not like about this car? There really isn't much I can say that I don't like. The things that I felt wasn't enough, I only felt that way when I was sitting in the vehicle. I felt like the car wasn't noisy enough. We all know that that sound, that growl, that initial growl that cars give. I always felt like it wasn't noisy, like it, it wasn't loud enough. You know, it wasn't aggressive enough. But I'm in the car, in tinted windows, all the way up, you know? As a matter of fact, time yeah. out. Yo, hit that clip right now where the car is taking off with the noise so they can hear how loud it is. And when I stand outside of the car or, you know, someone else is, you know, driving it, I'm like, oh, wow, we could do that. <laughs> <laughs> I underestimated you, C7. I didn't give it a name. That's weird to me. But um, the car name is weird? To me, so I, I don't know. So Kitty is weird? For me, no, oh! for me. <laughs> I said for me, I just didn't give it a name. Right, whatever, whatever. You know, because I wasn't sure if it was a man or a woman, you know, so. I got you. 
I got you. My new car, though. That's that's, that's all. That? That's all, lady. Oh, it's a lady. That's a lady. It's definitely a got lady. Got a small waist, Ooh. and it's loud and they feisty. Yep. Ooh, but it's powerful. Yeah. Ooh. Yep. Y'all not ready. Mm -hmm. Y'all not ready, man. So I'm just gonna shape it up a little bit. Ah, uh, you know what, man? Let's change this up a little bit. Let's mm -hmm. hop in the car mm -hmm. and uh, take us for a cruise, Gwen. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Take us for a cruise. We can Let's do hop that. in and then we. Let's go in this little quiet car. Hey. <laughs> All right, man. So we in the top down. You know, that's a beautiful thing I like about these cars. Yeah. The the ability to have like the open air and it's a beautiful thing, man. Yeah, especially without the cloth top. Oh, that's right, because the convertibles don't. I don't. Happen. I do not like cloth tops. Okay. Not your thing? No. <laughs> so you like the idea of having the Targer where you could just take off this part, but it's still got a sexy roof line. Yes. Either give me an automatic or a Targa. If it's not that, I don't want it. Okay. So a hard top folding roof or a Targa. Exactly. Okay. Well, there you go, man. But that's why I like this car so much. It gives you everything, right? Mm. It gives you the open air experience. You still have a sports car. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Sexy. Sexy as hell. You better stop yepping me. <laughs> yep. Give me more than yep. Jeez. No, what I what I will tell you though is back to my size, right? Yep. You know how many scratch marks I created on the back of that rear spoiler? Trying to reach in. Trying to put that top inside of the trunk. Forget <laughs> it. Forget it. The first one was a gouge, like a gouge. I, I couldn't. I, could, I, I ended up ordering like a almost like a, a exercise Paddle mat kind of. Paddle shift down the first for me. Fancy. Didn't even know it could do that. Did you hear that pop, 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 pop? I love this. Now I'm like, I'm out, I should have just kept it. I didn't even know I could do all of this. There you go. <laughs> Let's go, Quinn. Let's go, Quinn. Now that you get rid of the car, you I know. Now we want to be having all types of fun. Yeah. But, Did it make it feel like it's ready to go? But I, 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 I will say, when you guys, when I share with you guys the vehicle that I did choose, track mode is problems. Track, track mode, huh? All day? Yep. I don't All care. Right. I don't well, care. Well, you're giving away hints. Now they know that the car has a care. track mode. I don't care how much gas it burns. <laughs> <laughs> you just want that sound. Yep. You want that part. Yep. And then when I'm in stealth mode, I'll put Let it down to like you, economy. Let me ask you, does the car, does the top come off? Oh, uh, is it two or four doors? We could at least say that. No, definitely not four. All right, so it's a two, so it's a coupe. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. No, it's a it's a two door. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Don't we try to give hints? All right, we ain't gonna give away too much. We ain't gonna give away too much. But man, I really like the um the C7. I just wish that I could fit better in the car, like right. the C5, C6s. They were bigger without this big tunnel kind of oh, in the okay, middle. Okay. But like for your size, it's, it's you know, you're good. It's perfect. And for guys' normal height, mm -hmm. it's also perfect. They don't yes. have to worry Steph about it. Steph is like things. seven feet tall for those of you who have never met him in person. <laughs> I'm not seven feet. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you should. Oh, you like that though. Yeah, yeah this is nice. Just step in real quick. to stop the hair from blowing. I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. That's and this the only is bad why, thing. Believe it or not, this is why I didn't take the top off that often. Right. I had to hair. put. A, I had to either put a hat on or put my hair back. So. Okay. One of the things I loved about this vehicle, and and many other vehicles have it too, is the technology, which what? is weird because it's an American car, right? Right. So talk to me. What What about the technology? Android Auto. Forget Phenomenal. It. Yeah. Yeah, that it's hands down, like, yeah, it's a very simple system, just like most other um, American vehicles. Yeah. But Android, Apple, you absolutely need that in the vehicle. And the touch screen and all of that. Yes. All the facilities and how to use it. Yeah, I definitely feel you on that. Yeah, definitely. Well, we can put the windows up. That makes it easier for you. I was just Not trying to get this last one. Woo. My bad. My bad. Better? Okay. 
technology, Android Auto. Yes. Um, touch screen, everything. Yes. What do you keep? You know, these cars have a hidden compartment behind the screen. What do you keep it there? Never mind. Never mind. Don't answer that. <laughs> I forgot um, what I was, uh, oh, shit, I forgot who I was talking to. Um, <laughs> I keep my MP3 player. I keep there you my go. iPod back there. there. I go. just aged myself MP3 player. MP3 um, player. <laughs> yes, I, I keep my iPod back there. Yes, I still have an iPod. I need my phone for other things. All right, cool, cool, cool. Well, that's what's <laughs> up, man. Um, the, the feature content is definitely way better in the C7 than it was. Like, th these interiors actually look complete. Mm -hmm. The older vets, right. the interiors was terrible. Oh. My, I have a C5, yeah. and the interior is garbage. <laughs> <laughs> it is garbage. So they, this car is like leaps and bounds better. And for that reason, it got a lot of people who wouldn't typically buy a Corvette to buy a Corvette. Yeah. Same thing happened with uh, pickup trucks. The newer ones, yeah. they're like luxury vehicles on they the They are on the inside now. Yeah. They do everything. Ooh. When hitting them with the ooh wee, hey, 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 oh. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> nah, don't get it twisted, man. I've seen Gwen really drive this car and push it. So don't think that she just got the car and she not like, oh. you know. I've seen her really get in it. Yeah. yeah. But I am excited, although I'm very sad. Mm -hmm. I'm sad to see the car go. I'm I, excited I for you for the next chapter and yeah. you know what's gonna happen. How do you feel? You know, it is bittersweet because I do love this car, but I'll grow to love the next one also. So <laughs> that's just the way it goes, you know? Um, so the question is, um, we not gonna release the car on our channel first. So where can they find the car when you get it? Finally, is what some of them will be saying. Uh, <laughs> um, I'm gonna release it on on my YouTube channel, uh, Gwenro. Nice, nice. Finally, yeah. you're doing this YouTube exactly. thing. Exactly. Yes. You're gonna get serious about it. Now. Yes, yes. Now Yo. I have a little bit more time on my hands. So Gwen is my sister from another Mister, and she has every resource that I have. She has access to you guys nonstop whenever she feels like it. So. You guys encourage her and go to her channel right now. It's gonna be excellent content, I can guarantee you. Yes. And even if you just get to look at her, which I know some of y'all, remember I said that's my sister, <laughs> uh, some of y'all just wanna do anyway. Right. But go check out her channel, man. I, 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 I can't wait for y'all to see what she's getting next. She told me, and I got one big hint for you guys, one big hint, uh, and that's the fact that the car that she's getting has been on our channel before. Not, <laughs> the, like... not the exact car that was in the video, but the same car mm -hmm. that she's getting has been on the Montefame YouTube channel before. So, you got some homework to do. What? Let's 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 create a prize for these people, man. For whoever yes. gets it right, based on looking at the the content and stuff like that. Gwen. <coughs> What are you gonna do for them on your channel for the person that guesses it right? And yes, I'm putting you on the spot. Oh, I'm like, I didn't know we were gonna I'm put me on, you the on the spot. <laughs> if they guess it right, the first person to get it right, the car that you're getting next, they're gonna comment on your channel what they think you're getting okay. on the last video that you posted. Mm -hmm. They're gonna comment on your channel. Okay. What are you gonna give them? You're gonna get a shout out and you're gonna get a t-shirt. I didn't think it was gonna be all that. Well, I thought know. it was just gonna be a shout out. So there you go. Yeah. You're gonna get a, a Gwen Rowe merch and you're gonna get a shout out on her channel. So I strongly suggest that you guys do your research right now and then go got, go comment on her last video, the car that you think that she's getting. Well, you already at. have a hint of at You least. got a strong hint. You exactly. know it's a two door. Mm -hmm. You know it's a coupe. You know it's, she said that it's shaped like a lady. She said it's sexy with a small waist and big hips. So they, they, that's a lot of hit for y'all. So make sure you go there and go to Gwen Rowe yes. channel, comment on her last video, what you think the car is gonna be. And Gwen, you better get them their t-shirt and they shot. I know, I know. Don't let them down. Well, let's see. Well, the question is, will they guess before the video comes out? That's a real good question. The time is ticking, clock is ticking. Time is ticking. Hi, y'all. Uh, yo, it's your boy Stephanie from Mind the Fame, and I'm here with 
Gwenro from Gwenro. Run. <laughs> Run with Gwenro. That's it, baby. Yes. And uh, this one has been an awesome one. My sister, I'm glad to see the Corvette go. It's an amazing car. Yes. I'm so happy for you, and I'm so proud of you. Thank you. I am so, so proud of you, girl. Thank you. I'm so <laughs> proud of you. I'm excited for what's to come, guys. All right, man. And it's going to be on the channel all summer. But until the next one, it's your boy stepping in from my 